Hi everyone, welcome back. Today we're going to be looking at some of the goodies or not so goodies in the Michaels grab bag. I have watched a few grab bag openings and some of the people that received them got a lot of letters and they weren't happy with that. And I totally understand it. But you could always find people with those names like I have been looking for specific letters and I have not been able to find them. Um, I know a lot of vowels are usually taken, so that kind of sucks. But anyway, I have a feeling a lot of this stuff is going to be post-Halloween or fall-themed items. And I'm totally okay with that because Halloween does come once a year. So we can always use them and I can always gift them out next year. Or I can make a lot of pocket, not pocket letters, flip books and put them in there or just share so that's enough of rambling I'm just gonna go ahead and get started so I haven't dug inside of the grab bags and I got three of them and as you notice the price has went up from two dollars to three dollars I noticed some of the less expensive items that Michael has has increased you know their stamps used to be a dollar then it went to a dollar fifty and now they're two dollars so, you know, we just got to roll with the tide or not get them. I personally have been trying to find some cute stamps at other stores for the same price or less when they have um, coupons or 50% off. So anyway, enough rambling. And the first thing that I pull out of my bag is these. Stickers. I was actually going to buy this and I got two of those I was actually going to buy those when they were 80% off and I'm glad I didn't because now I got my money's worth with just one package of things and then these um, I guess it's create a pumpkin which I think is awesome and it's this spiders and you know if they have the googly eyes inside and they have the um, pom poms, you don't have to do what they say do. You can definitely make something else. And this would be good to gift to my child's school as well. Okay, so we have some cheesecloth. Lots of cheesecloth. Lots of cheesecloth. So I got some white, black, and blood tinge then this raven's claw manor wall decor and these are cute and even with this extra space um you can always cut out or die cut and they have these things in there so this is pretty cool i actually like that a lot and i didn't see that at the michaels when it was on regular sale another one of these googly eyes and this is just um, little creatures another package some bats spiders and witches hats so I want to just show you guys one thing so when I open this box I took everything out just to go over this really quickly these are stars it doesn't have to be stars to go on the bat so that's cool they also have these mini pipe cleaners, and we can definitely do something with this. And with Thanksgiving and Christmas coming up, we could definitely use this for some Thanksgiving or Christmas decor. This string as well, we can tie this onto some ornaments. These googly eyes could be on any project. And these little smiley faces or half moons could go onto something else. So... Um, if you ladies or gentlemen do go and get these bags, don't think that it just has to be Halloween because this little cat's face, you can definitely do something besides make a black cat for Halloween. And these hats could be elf hats, um, for Christmas. So you can have Santa's helpers. The spiders... And the bats, well, you know, those are that. But this spider could be Charlotte's Web, for example. And this little bat face, if you think about it, you can cut the wings off. 
and he looks like a pig this little snout could be a pig snout so don't get discouraged if you get a chance to get some grab bags and has a lot of Halloween stuff in there just look at your crafts and see what you can create okay so I was mistaken I have another one of these in the same bag and these milk jars with these little um, skeletons on there I think are really awesome I didn't see these but it says boo at the bottom and you know you could definitely do something with this for next year um, since it says boo in the bottom of it and I'm not sure if this peels off but you can put some pens and pencils in there and this could be a teacher's gift so that's really cool so if you have small children or you like to just give things out you don't have to worry about that here's another box of crafts for the kiddos and all of these are so cool I actually had bought some of these and now I'm kind of mad at myself I didn't wait but I didn't know they were going to have grab bags with lots of Halloween things but this says cat scratch fever unsanitized I think that's cute and this one says eat drink and be scary and then these are just flowers and these were $1.49 and even though it says Halloween I don't see this as a Halloween project at all this can definitely be something totally different and then this vanilla bean candle I just sniffed it and it didn't smell like anything to me and then they have this little cute little pumpkin stamp it's probably lost this ink because the lid is missing but you, know, you can re-ink it and stamp away if you like and actually if I find the lid it stamps pretty decent so I'll look for the lid in this bag if not It'll just have to dry out or that could be something that goes in the trash. And this says keep calm, which the M piece is missing and eat candy. So we could just break these letters off if we needed to. Um, spider web. And these could always be painted. This could actually be on a window. It doesn't have to be a spider web. It could be a, a spider web broken window. If you're doing something like that, another box of these little creature thingies and tons and tons of these. And I never saw these at Michael's. That one I never saw. I never saw this one. Now, would I have purchased this with my own money, like individually? Some of the stuff I would have because I thought it was cute and I like little bags of lots of randomness so here's another one of those but these in my opinion you know I think it was a good purchase I got my money's worth I got my money's worth off of one of the items do I miss that they were two dollars in the past yes of course I do because I could have got instead of using that one that extra dollar I probably could have got another grab bag but overall I think my money worth was gotten and look at this skeleton you know you can definitely do a stencil with this um, could be something else you can turn this skeleton to somebody that's funny you can slap some of those googly eyes in his head and do something with so yep and just in this bag is more and more of these um, wooden pieces and even with this if you don't like this you could always paint over it slap some scrapbooking paper on there and you can have a sign so it's many things we can do with it I'm not sure of who likes spiders but you could do something with the spiders if you wanted to I probably won't alter much of these pictures unless I can think of something um, that I definitely want to have like I see these kitty cats and um, they're purple. Maybe I can paint these black and put some something on them. Excuse the rattling of the bag. And I just like frogs, so I thought that was cute. And I actually purchased this when it was regular price or maybe 50% off. But now, I mean, 
I think this is all good. I'm going to open up the other bag and show you all what I got in there and then we'll wrap this video up. Okay, seems like my wish was fulfilled. I got a letter and it's an A and it's a nice little box. I don't really know any ladies that I'm close to that has A in their name. I have an A in my name, but it doesn't begin with an A. And these things were originally 30 bucks. And I got four A's, looks like, from looking inside this bag. So, if I do another giveaway anytime soon, yep, you all will be getting an A. So, I got four A's. And then, this is another thing that I was going to, I was looking at purchasing. And I'm glad I didn't. Um cute items of course some of these things I could take out like the stars I could probably take out and use for other things the little kitty cat I actually had a black cat growing up so that could be taken out um, maybe these purple stars could be taken out so those could definitely be used for other things I don't carve pumpkins but they have these pumpkin carving tools in there maybe in a few years I will have those but you know these could be in a giveaway or some randomness if someone was to ask for it I may consider consider it or I may use it for other crafting tools then this was in there as well and this says for artificial pumpkins so those little styrofoam pumpkins probably I'm not sure and then this right here is just some glitter and these little ghosts, even though it's Halloween-y, those ghosts could be used for other things. And those masks could be used for like Mardi Gras because um, it's coming up. I do have a question for all of you. When do you think you're going to see the first glimpse of Valentine's Day? Do you think it's going to be before Christmas or after Christmas? I'm guessing it's going to be right after Thanksgiving we'll see some Valentine's Day stuff. Anyway, this is a house with a mask on it, and you can easily turn this face into something else, and it can be a gingerbread house if you don't put this marshmallow-looking ghost thing stack on there. So some of these items we could use for Halloween. I mean, not Halloween, um, some of the upcoming seasons. Like, look at these. These could all be used for... Mardi Gras, you can throw some feathers on there and bling it up. Um, I have more of these boxes. At the Michaels near my house, they did have a lot of these still waiting to be sold and they didn't sell. So um, I'll probably break down the, the items inside and just group everything together. So if I do a giveaway, you may get some of this stuff. If you're into Halloween, I don't want to force anything on anyone. And these, this is cute, bookmarks. Um, but of course, it's what we make it. So if these are not attached to it, this could be anything. And if this face is something, it could be a plain pumpkin. And we can make smiley faces out of it. Um, another one of these. Another one of those. And another one of those. So overall, I believe that I got my money's worth. It was only $3. And thinking about the actual price of these items, I wholeheartedly feel that I got my money's worth. Um, a lot of these things cost a lot of money. And... I'm excited about the possibilities of doing something else with it. I mean, if you think about it, this could definitely be altered into something else. It's a lot of things we could alter these things into. So anyway, thank you all for watching. Let me what, know what you think about the randomness of the Michaels gift grab bags. And how do you feel about the prices increasing? Do you think with a lot of us doing um, grab bag videos and different videos we're driving the price to go up for supply and demand or do you just think the economy is changing and michael's trying to recoup some of their money thanks for watching happy crafting have a great day